afternoon, class. Let's do one more worksheet on division word problems. Now, there are six word problems on this worksheet, but we're just going to do one a day. These are like real life word problems. So you might come across one of these uh, situations in real life one day. All right, so let's get started. This first one. Mrs. Brand brought four evenly divided boxes of muffins to class. There are 36 muffins all together. How many muffins are there in each box? Okay, so there's four muffin boxes. So let's say if your teacher, let's say I brought four boxes of muffins in the class and your favorite is say blueberry. Well, you're hoping that there's enough blueberry muffins in a box so that you might get one of them. Okay, so we're going to start with how many muffins there are all together. And that number is 36. Okay, so that's our dividend. That's what we're dividing up is 36. Okay, let's put the division sim symbol. Kind of looks like a tent. We have 36, the dividend under the tent. Okay, and then there's four boxes. That's going to be our divisor. That's how many times we'll, well, actually we're going to see how many times four goes into 36. So we can think four times what equals 36. How many muffins are there in that box? The quotient or the answer, that's what we're after. So let's go ahead and go to our multiplication table. Okay, so we're going to start with the divisor, which is 4, and then go all the way down until we see the dividend, which is 36. There it is right there. So let's go find our answer by going straight across. And we found it. The answer is 9. That is our quotient. Does 4 times 9 equal 36? Okay, 4 times 9. It does, according to our multiplication chart, it sure does. So, hopefully you guys can use division whenever you come upon a situation like this. So it'll make it a lot faster and maybe you're the one buying the muffins. So this will help you um, not overbuy or underbuy. Okay, well, I will see you guys in the morning. Have a great day.